Since we're still in Skype quarantine episodes, we are doing another fan film. And since My. last quarantine thing, we did Terminator fan films, I decided we are doing now Stallone fan films. Coming back next week. Eh, I don't know. We'll have to see. No, I'm coming back next week. Two weeks is up. Come back next week. We'll have to see. You shut me out for good. I fuck you and your paranoid wife. We'll see. We'll see what she says. Oh, what are you, Donald Trump now? We'll see. Yeah. No, it is no. it is. All built in the Constitution of Worst Movie on Rule. There are no. no. <laughs> yeah, I was like, there are no rules. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, since we're doing Stallone fan films, I have found us a Rocky fan film to talk about called Rocky Redemption. And you were so nice to share it with everyone. Well, dude, we had such a we had such a good time with El Cobra last week. I thought, you know, we would have fun with this. Did we have such a great time? I don't recall such the great time that I had. Yeah, it really wasn't that great of a time. It wasn't like, you know, um, Godzilla versus Mito come on. It was like 20 seconds long. and It was just him still on a scene, basically, you know, and poorly, I might add. You know, this one, he just got it was just one long workout montage. Shitty, I might add. We'll get into that. So he was like poking out like Batman worked out, Batman versus Superman, you know, because like I don't know, like there was some people who were like, you can afford all this stuff, but he chooses to work out with like bricks and shit. <laughs> but yeah, we'll get into all that because it starts off with the Rocky theme. So I'm not going to be playing hardly any of the audio for this because one, there is no dialogue at all. Two, yeah. it, is, it is all stolen ass Rocky music. So I'm going to replace the music with something that does not fit. I don't know what I'm doing yet, but I'm going to replace it with something stupid. Good. I'm going to go onto YouTube's music library to their like you know royalty free stuff, and I'm just going to find the stupidest music find I whatever, fucking can. Find whatever whatever says lame ass shit, and like use that. Yeah. So anyway, so then we get to see Rocky. Rocky is El Cobra. Yeah. I swear to God, dude. Yeah, same fucking people, same fucking everything. See, I be Rocky Barbora. I'm like, no, you're not. So, yeah, so since Rocky's just standing there being all cool, we get to see the title. <laughs> like a subway shop or something or something like a deli like he'd be serving sandwiches to you you know yeah but i mean or, he does got, he's got he's got that hard fat gut you know like that one you could punch like fucking like bow and it wouldn't do nothing to him he'd be like what that's it they do nobody talks about the hard fat dude there's guys out there with hard fat you know like i'm sure you in places you probably have hard fat you know it's fat but it's still hard now you know what I mean? and uh yeah. <laughs> like my wiener uh, no, see, I knew it was going to go there. Well, That's doesn't like, it always end up on wieners? Yeah. But anyway, we'll get more into his hard fat when he's topless, okay? Well, so, Chow, we get... Chow white fat. We get more El Rocky. <laughs> El Rocky. And, and then we cut to Rocky waking up at 5.45 a.m. Don't bother doing the bonehead thing that I did and look up Rocky in Spanish because chances are she's going to say Rocky. <laughs> yeah, I did. I wasn't worried about it. So, Ellie, yeah. oh. El Rocky goes to the fridge, no eggs, and kind of, you know, just kind of solid film acts. <laughs> I did. 
I missed the part of him going to the fridge. I saw him get up. It was all dark, but like, yeah, I didn't see the fridge part. Like, he did, there was no egg part. He didn't drink the egg. No, he went there and there was like nothing in his fridge. So he like silent film acted like you know, ah ah ah, and then fucking yeah, it cut. El Rocco didn't get any nutrients for work. No, he did not because he it cuts out film. Well, because it cuts now to a workout montage. And that is basically almost the rest of this fan film. And that's pretty much what it is. It's just that with, uh, you know, uh, it, with, with the music, which, you know, we don't have to play, obviously. But yeah, I we're could... playing stupid music. Stupid music, remember? I'm finding stupid music. Right, but the real music that was playing over his, of course, was the Rocky, you know? Yeah. Like, gonna try now, and I'm like, or some bullshit, like, you know, and I'm like, yes, I'm really struggling to try to pay attention to this crap. So anyway, let's watch some of the workout with the not Rocky music. And then guess what? We get more fucking workout. Well, that well, who was like, you know, he didn't like it'd be different. Like if he was going up against an opponent, like if he had an opponent, like, you know, uh, like <laughs> anybody, El, El Cobra Lang or something like that, or uh, dude, he needs to go against El Cobra, El Cobra <laughs> versus El Rocky. Yeah, oh, I know. That would be fucking great. Split Wasn't screen the with their split screen with their technology, man. You imagine how great that fight would be. Wait a minute, wasn't this the same person? I thought it was the same guy. It is the same guy. So I said split screen. They'd yeah. have to fight split screen. So you know how awful that would be? You know what's really weird is like you work out, but like all the fat from your body that, that, that left your body goes to your head. And it just sticks there, stores there. Like there's a lot of guys. Like there's like you see like these strongman guys. I mean, some of these guys have abs. But they get this fucking big ass wah 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 wah. So you're basically you're basically talking about yourself, right? You're you're leading saying other guys, but you're basically complaining for you, right? Like what you do when you talk about other guys' penises. Well, we mean I say many things about other guys' penises. So you gotta like specify. <laughs> like like not, whatever I talk about I'm not talking about when you like uh, you wanna figure out how many licks it takes to get to the center of a you know. Of a fleshy pop. Of a hopeless man's tootsie pop. (laughs) But anyway. (laughs) We get past all the yeast and shit first. We cut to El Rocky running now, kind of in fast motion, with Rocky music on it, but of course, not Rocky music here. Was this where he was running down the street? Like, he was mimicking the run, like, when Rocky did the run, and everybody, all the kids followed him and shit. Well, yeah, it, it, it cuts a few times back to that. You're sitting there, right? And you're at a park. And all of a sudden, this beefy Italian dude runs past you, you know, sweating like a whore. And all of a sudden, your kid bolts off after him. And then another kid. And another kid. And you're like, what the fuck? All of a sudden, these fucking kids, like children of the corn, start chasing after him and stuff. And you're, like, just sitting there in the park, like, what the fuck just happened? Like, my kid just up and dipped. Because he watched that scene, the kids are just coming from every direction. Well, by that point, he was already, like, you know, he was already on TV, and he was already going, they, everybody knew he was going to be fighting fucking um, Apollo, right? Right. And everybody knew him in that part of Philly anyway. Everybody kind of loved Rock anyway, so it's not like it was that weird. Like, he was just some random guy. Not enough, to, not enough to just chase them down. You know what I mean? Like, I don't give a fuck. Well, like, hey, we're up. Go. See ya. You know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's well, but me. also, the only thing we're chasing after is the fucking ice cream truck. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so. We're chasing after the guy who just bolted out of the donut store, you know, is chasing after rug. Get the fuck back here. We're not even chasing rug. We're chasing his ass. <laughs> <laughs> So anyway, fuck man. The kids and the kids are all like, oh yeah. Oh, 
of a sudden you see us just fucking slam into some dude like fucking dickhead. Uh, take his yeah. dozen of Krispy Kremes and into the night we ride. Yeah, we'll go up to Ruck with the box open with like, you know, a glazed half eat. And yeah, just shove half one in our mouth. Like, good luck, Ruck. So anyway, more workout. <laughs> We're Pittsburgh slobs. We could easily be Philly slobs. You know, I could see us being in Philly and just being the same slobs. Yeah. You know, interchangeable. You know, so that's why I never really talk shit about Philly because I'm like, I could easily be in Philly. Yeah. <laughs> I could easily be part of it. The only thing different is like the slang and stuff. Yeah. And the accent. That's really about it. They, I think, you know, who takes the, uh, the, the, like winning and losing as far as the NFL more serious, Philly or Pittsburgh? I don't know, dude. I'm not Pittsburgh. They get violent when they win. They won the Super Bowl and they burnt the city down. (laughs) But anyway, now we cut to El Rocky and he's fucking punching a heavy bag. What was it? Cooler. I think it was just like one of those blue foam mats. I think he just rolled it up and taped it. I don't know. Cardboard box he was beating on. Somebody was holding it for him. You know, and it didn't even look like his it looked like he had his his hands taped up with toilet paper. You know, it didn't even look like real wraps. Well, dude, remember this this is the guy that his gun in Cobra was a remote control. Okay, so but anyway. So we're, so we're not rolling out his hand wraps were probably made of toilet paper. <laughs> yeah, it could be. I didn't notice that. But you didn't notice the remote control gun, so we get, guess what? More fucking workout. So, I mean, are you there? Like, you are you froze? Oh, I thought you froze. I was thinking about something for a second. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Uh, but yeah, it's like if you think about it, this movie, it's kind of like Rocky Four because Rocky Four is montage the movie. Yes, but it's it's a good montage of a movie. It's not a guy lifting fake bricks with a broom handle, with his heart, with his stomach hanging out. So now we get him running in more fast motion. <laughs> like jesus this is this is this is like the longest montage i've witnessed in quite some time but it's not though if you think about this movie was six minutes long dude the montages in rocky four are longer than this movie yeah but okay what's great is though now he we get to see el rocky kitty scratch punching the heavy bag he's like yeah like I want a lot in our movies, man. In the Terminator one, Kitty Scratch. Eyes of the Werewolf, Kitty Scratch. Uh oh, the bad signal. But uh, anyway, I uh, forgot what I was gonna say. No, I I like uh, I like the montage. Um, like it would have worked if he had maybe a couple other guys around him. Maybe yeah, was just him. Sitting there, but like, dude, the ending was my favorite. Just him bouncing his gut and his head, like all his neck fat, you know, because it was all up here, <clears throat> like, like an inflated tire, you know, like somebody put a fat guy's head on this dude's body. But we'll we'll get into that in a little bit because first we get to see Rocky standing there and the camera is pulling back. <laughs> Runs up six, count them six steps. Not Yay! six. six and he steps. celebrates. He was doing the rock. 
Rocky thing. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he does the Rocky jump freeze frame. And that's it. Well, it shows like the end of Rocky where him and Apollo were in the ring, but it doesn't show any anything, just like the very far off shot, you know? It's like, that's weird. Why put that in there? And then it shows like people from whatever Rocky movie, I can't remember what it is. Rocky Balboa was the one they were taking, the Asian family was taking pictures of the statue. And... Uh, that might have been the Creed one. Yeah, I can't remember. Well, I know, it was one of the it was one of the later one, you know, right. one of the very old man Rockies. Yeah, great too, probably. But um, and then we get credits, and you're like, why? You know, it's like okay, there, okay. You show a statue of Rocky, which you're clearly not, you know. And mm-hmm. these people are taking a picture. Then it cut. It has his name at the top. So he's Rocky Balboa. And then has credited everybody who was in Rocky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I remember seeing Paulie in this one at all? You know, he didn't have that. Dude, that'd have been so cool if there was like a a Mexican Paulie. Yes, dude. I was just fucking thinking that. One hundred and ten percent. Yes, this dude needed another dude with him to be El Pauly. Yes. And L A Adrian. Yes. Yes. Señorita, Adrian. Well, since this is supposed to be an old Rocky movie, I guess, you know, uh, Adrian could be dead already, like she was. So, but, I mean, we still need old Polly. But, I mean, Polly right. died, too, right? After well, eventually, he, yeah, eventually. He, he, he survived all the way up until, like, the Rocky Balboa. Yeah, but, but then he, he wasn't... In, in Creed, he was dead. Yeah, he was dead before Creed. Like, it was in between Rocky Balboa and Creed, I think. Right, right. Yeah, Paul, I know, I know. Paul, happy yeah. birthday, Polly. Happy birthday, Polly. Happy birthday, Polly. God damn it. How, how, that, always, 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 dude. Dude, I just wished I knew somebody named Polly. Just when it was their birthday, call them up and go, happy birthday, Polly. <laughs> and have the music. So, yeah, that was Rocky Redemption. Redemption. <laughs> I mean, what he was redeeming himself from, I don't know. But it is what it is. Don't you hate that fucking Trump used that stuff now? So now, like, any time that, like, that phrase I use a lot. So now every time I say it, I'm like, fucking orange fucking bastard. Dude, if that, if, if that fucking goddamn Cheeto Mussolini comes out and says blah, blah, fucking blah someday, I'm, I'm straight blowing my head off. What do you? Oh, oh, OK. I thought you meant if he came out and said something. I didn't know he meant, he meant blah, blah, fucking blah. Yeah, like, if he does, like, you know, was up there, because, you know, he's, I, I can see him saying something along those lines, because he said worse. So, yeah. I can, I can only imagine, dude, I would blow my head off, because I would never be able to say it again, ever. You think he's watching us? No. I'm going to say, but if it just came out of his adult old man mind, I would, like, you know, I would shoot myself, because I would never be able to say it again. Dude, I'd be blown away if he mentioned our show. Like, I only listened. The gutter and bird. I'm like, God damn, yes. I'm like, we um, have control now. I'd be like, Zod. <laughs> I'd, be get, I'd be getting a hold of the president. <laughs> uh, on that note, for gutter and bird, this has been another one of the... Your turn. Where's movies on a YouTube? We'll see you later. Yeah, but it was, I don't know. I hate it. Stupid commercial. Five dollar foot long. I hate head. Subway in general. Subway is just it's cr- all around crap food. It used to be good. Uh, yeah, Dude, I remember going to old school Subway back in the day when I was a fucking kid, and I remember, um, like my neighbor or whatever owned a Subway or ran a Subway. And, like, yeah, dude, everything. Like, when they said it was fresh, I saw them cutting the shit. It was fresh. He always made bomb-ass sandwiches. Goddamn fucking spider butt. I think it's okay. Spider butt. Spider butt. Spider butt. Spider butt.
what's up. Obviously, I'll wait. So. <laughs> Crack yourself a cold. Dude, oh my god. <laughs> oh, he's... What? What? <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> Why? You, you, I fucking hate you. I think you're up to some shit. Huh? I think you're up to some shit. Why am I up to some shit? Because... It's just like the Terminator thing. You're like, oh, hey, look, this guy has another movie. I think you fucking know he has movies. And you're like, oh. No, I, I did not know he was in a second one because the second one was only, re- the one we did that we're doing today was only released like two weeks ago. <laughs> By <laughs> chance. Well, remember how in that episode I said, oh, no, we might end up, well, the episode didn't come out yet, but I said about how you said about, like, oh, this better not be a theme talking about, like, pedophilia. <laughs> and I was like, no, mo- more than likely we'll end up doing a Stallone fan film theme. So that's why I looked for another Stallone fan film, and I just saw Rocky, because I looked up um, Rambo fan films, couldn't find any. There was one that was like twenty some minutes long that looked like it was like pretty bad, but it was like it was long and boring. And I'm like, neither one of us want to sit there and watch a twenty minute long, boring Rambo fan film. So yeah, so yeah, I saw this Rocky one and I clicked on it and it fucking came up and the title came up and I was like, wait a minute, I, that name looks familiar. And then he stands in there and I'm like, oh fuck, Dude, you know it was great. Is when the music was playing "Trying Hard Doll," and I'm just in my head. I'm like, ah, "Ain't that the truth?" <laughs> trying hard now to concentrate to this crap. <sighs> so yeah, I'm ready to start a, a workout montage, and then his fat ass shaking up and down on in on steps that are clearly not in this country. <laughs> well, dude. There were six steps. He ran up six steps. I think it's hilarious, though, that he gave credit to <laughs> all the ones of Rocky that weren't in it. Try a card now. <laughs> so, yeah, I'll start it here in a second. <coughs> <coughs> Please don't do anything on my account. I beg of you. <laughs> Well, I figured, you know, we'll do another Chronicles thing. I like those. Those are fun. And everybody enjoyed the last one, so. Uh, I was going to make a Ram Man reference, but, like, I don't think I need to. <laughs> yeah, dude, that's great. I like, yeah, on Discord, Kevin called me mean for making that thumbnail. I'm like, no. Bird sent me that oh, fucking that picture. Thumbnail. I'm like, this, I knew the moment I got it that it was going to be the thumbnail. <laughs> you know, so don't be like, you're mean. No. <laughs> yeah. Like, no, I don't even, does anybody even know that it's my body? No, just probably just like the Discord people because of you putting that, you know, one on there. Oh. On general, and then also now watch party on Sunday. We were talking about because remember I said to you I was going to make that the thumbnail. Like yeah. we talked about it on there, so yeah, like Kevin, Laramie, and Jason and stuff, you know, yeah. would know. But trying hard now. <laughs> if I can get this a little higher. Yeah, sure leave yourself, leave yourself a, little, a little room on top because I have noticed it does cut off the top and bottom some, like whenever I download it. You know? Okay. So, yeah, you're good. But anyway. Oh, what happened? Uh, bird? Hello? I hate when somebody tries to call me. 
Okay. <laughs> it's cool. Everything out. It's cool. We weren't really talking. We weren't in the middle of anything. We were kind of in a, a, a law. So that's kind of the perfect place for it to happen, really. But I forgot what I was going to say. Yeah, so, so did I. I was going to say something, too. But it doesn't fucking matter. So, 